The Top 5 Business Technology News Stories from the Past Week Number 5 Are you curious about how much watch time shows get on Netflix? Netflix has published data on approximate hours watched by show on their service. The spreadsheet can be downloaded from their website and has over 18,000 titles from the last six months. Netflix plans to publish this data every six months going forward. Number 4. Twitch, the online streaming platform updated its content policy to allow artistic nudity and days later rolled back the changes. Twitch said, much of the content created has been met with community concern. These are concerns we share. Upon reflection, we have decided that we went too far with this change. Digital depictions of nudity present a unique challenge. AI can be used to create realistic images, and it can be hard to distinguish between digital art and photography. Number 3. Google has lost its court case against Epic Games. The jury determined that Google turned its Google Play App Store and Google Play billing service into an illegal monopoly. The judge in the case is scheduled to consider remedies next month. Interestingly, Apple runs an almost identical store on their platform and won a similar case in 2021. Number 2. Tesla is restricting the functionality of its autopilot driver assistance software in response to a recall involving 2 million vehicles. This recall marks one of the initial outcomes stemming from an extensive, ongoing investigation by the National Highway Traffic Safety Administration (NHTSA), the United States' primary automotive safety regulator. According to documents, the NHTSA expresses concerns about the adequacy of Tesla's method for verifying whether drivers remain attentive to the road while utilizing auto-steer, a feature enabling vehicles to stay within their lane, even around curves. Number 1. General Motors struck a deal with commercial vehicle manufacturer Autocar to use its hydrogen fuel cell technology to power a range of heavy-duty work vehicles. Hydrogen fuel cells which use compressed hydrogen as their fuel and release water vapor as its only emission. GM has condensed its Hydrotech branded system into a power cube, encompassing 300 individual hydrogen fuel cells. GM says that while its Ultium branded EV battery packs are well suited for passenger vehicles, larger trucks and construction vehicles are in need of a different solution. 